Okay, everyone, last night you should have done your movie reviews, and yes, I do mean last night, not this morning. Uh, you, you expected us to do a movie review? L last night was Halloween, so, like, you really expected us to do a movie review? Yeah, I did, because newsflash, Halloween is for kids, and you guys have a lot of work to do. Movie reviews are really important because they help you plan and learn how to make films properly so that when you guys make your films, a whole bunch of stuff happens. Uh, excuse me, Olga? Is there something you want to share with the rest of the class? Oh, um, well, I was, um, looking at this, like, a uh, film, film video thing, and, um, a Christmas ad popped up. <sighs> Christmas is almost here. I can feel it in the air. Yeah, it's like time to drink hot cocos and, like, watch Hallmark movies where, like, the girl from a big city falls in love with a guy from a small city and it has something to do with a Christmas miracle. You're kidding, right? It's November. Why is she being such a Grinch? Oh my god, that is my favorite movie. Oh, Melody, you won't believe this. So I was in class and we were talking about some like film stuff or whatever. I was watching a YouTube video and a Christmas movie ad popped up out of nowhere. And then everybody in class started talking about how much they love Christmas. It's ridiculous. Don't they know that Christmas is in a month? So I'm guessing you don't want to wear coordinating Santa hats. Okay, listen, Christmas is probably one of my favorite holidays. Probably my favorite. But don't people know that in November, there's still Thanksgiving? Like, there's no need to celebrate Christmas yet. Don't they know that this meme exists? I got beans, greens, potatoes, tomatoes, lamb, where's the wall? Beans, greens, potatoes, tomatoes, chicken, turkeys, right? I just can't deal with all this Christmas stuff yet. Come on in, we're doing a seven step sketch in the shape of a Christmas tree. Ooh, come join my group. Plain and simple, these people are crazy. Are we just gonna forget the history lessons we had when we were younger about the pilgrims and how they came and they ate a lot of food? Why won't they just let Thanksgiving pass? I know you've been all angry about Christmas and stuff, but I'm having a party at my house and we're going to be decorating cookies and stuff. Yeah, you should totally come. There's even going to be caroling. Yeah. Uh, okay, I'll send you my address. She, she's not going to come. Didn't you finish your final? Um... Look at her, like, what? what's her problem? I don't, I don't know. So what are you doing for Christmas? Episode of Husky Vision. Oh my god, those people oh, will be so literally, cute. Literally. Too. We're in the middle of filming. Like, oh. Focus now. Ship, ship, ship! October 21st to the 24th was February week. Remember, pugs, not drugs. October 31st was the seniors' night for boys football. Good job, Huskies. And it was also Halloween. Let's see those spooky customs. Oh. Hello. So what are you guys for Halloween? Hey, what, what, what are we? What are we? Uh, we're the, the, the B. No, the we're the Bee Gees. We're the, the Bee Gees. Gees. <laughs> I'm a Karen. Wait, hold on. Hey, you got to zoom in on that. You see it? See the drip? That's the Karen right here. Yeah. Yeah. So creative. Thank you. What are you? I don't know. He's red bone. <laughs> you know Redbone? I don't know. I'm sure you're No, no, you're not like that. Uh, 
Uh, I'm just a regular dude. Uh, <laughs> Do you guys have any activities planned for Halloween? Yeah, what are we doing? Uh, so we're gonna go scare some children. Yeah, and then we're gonna go to the Chapman University, hide behind walls, and scare children. And, and then, then you know, after Chapman? that, we're playing like hitting the clubs and the parties. Yeah, the clubs. And we're gonna just go, go. just like this. Go to the parties. It'll be look good. It'll look good. Three or four. Go right. park. Modern day. Yeah. Okay. We're trying to dance. We're trying yeah, to make trying it lit. We're trying to dance, man. But they're not gonna play no music. They're not, they're not playing no, no you music. You can dance in front of the camera. If you... All right. We're trying to do. Now watch. No, no. Wait, 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 wait. What you wanna do? Now watch me whip. Hey, we start on the right, 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 right. Three, two, one. Now watch me whip. Yeah. Now watch me net it. Okay. Now watch me whip. Whip. Watch me net it. Okay. We good. Right. And one last question. So, uh, would you guys rather stay at a haunted house for for a night, or you know, at uh, we're at a graveyard? A haunted, haunted house. house. <laughs> why? Because um, what if the dead people just come out at me and then then what? Also, I'd rather stay inside than outside. A house has a bed. Hey, hey, wait, uh, graveyard? Or haunted house? I'm yeah. taking a haunted house. Yeah. Cause I live, a good graveyard is big. Are you outside? And you're yeah, outside. Yeah, I don't know, but still. Bro, no, like, imagine, like, they just come from yeah, everywhere, come like, you just, no. I, I stay in the house. Okay. I stay in the house. Got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Night work. Thank you very much. October 24th was Diwali. I hope everyone enjoyed the food the parents brought. On November 1st, the Fairmont Housing students went to the escape room. They certainly don't know the next day was the SAT. Hey, seniors, how did you guys do? Did you guys get that perfect, like, 1600, huh? huh? How's the college up going, huh? On October 25th was the Peace Summit. Remember to be kind. November 8th to the 10th was the Vapor Retreat. I wonder how it went, Lily. Uh, we wouldn't know, because neither of us went. <laughs> On November 11th was Veterans Day. I hope everyone enjoyed their day off and didn't procrastinate on their homework. November 14th to 16th was the fall play, Fools. Good job to everybody in the play, including me. I was a magistrate. <laughs> so how have you guys been preparing for this season? Um, a lot of conditioning. No. No, how are you oh, how are you? Wait, how are you prepared? Seven teens, okay, <laughs> next one. Um, so <laughs> we've been um, practicing um, in the weight room and also we've been going to hack and just practicing our touch, I guess. You know, we've just been, we've been, we've been, we've been grinding every day, you know. Uh, we got a new field now, we're over at Mabel. Uh, we've been taking uh, taking a lot of shots, you know. Uh, um, so we go to the field and we practice. Yeah. Uh, yo, got this, got this, got this, got this, got this. What do we do? Um, you know, we've just been practicing a lot. You know, we're we got some freshmen that are excellent players. You know, they've all been recruited by colleges already, and we're just looking forward to having them on our team. And they're all quality boys, and they're good players, but they're better people. You know. Do you have any pre-game routines? Dancing mm -hmm. most of the time. That's all we do. Oh, yeah. Listen to music. I just listen to music. Okay. Turn up. Turn up. Oh, that's it. Uh, handshakes. We go in the locker. We go in the locker. I don't even have a locker. Oh. What was the question? Kaylin likes to sleep. Do you guys have any pregame routines? Are we gonna do the? Uh, uh, no, 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 these freshmen haven't Fair played a game yet because they're freshmen, so what do you think your routine will be, Mr. Ricky? Oh. <laughs> um, do you think you're going to make CIF this year? I think we're going to win CIF this year. Yes, for sure. I'm not worried about CIF, I just want state. So. Do you think you can win CIF? Yes, positive attitude. Yes. No, 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 not CIF, but at least. Do you think you can win CIA? No! Right. Why yeah. is this okay. a terrible okay. question? Hey, don't up. answer <laughs> time! It's a microphone! So basically, no, no. don't ever listen to Andrew. Um, we're, we are gonna win, I promise. Like, we're, we're literally gonna win. You know, we're the number one seed, and we lost, like, 8-1, to one, so it was really depressing. So this year, we're planning on having a great regular season, a great playoffs, and bringing a banner to Fairmont Prep High School. Okay, so who's your best player? Oh, yeah, Lamin is a pretty good player. Christian is Slenderman, fam. <laughs>
Oh, Ty. Oh, Ty. Hey, shout out Ty. Ty, my boy Ty. Shout out Ty. Always in the gym, always grinding 24 7. You know the vibe. He has a documentary. He has a documentary. He's like that. He's like that. Nice like that. Go look him up. And who's your best player? Anling. Anling. Me. I agree. So, who is your best player? Kaylin. I don't know. Kaylin doesn't go to practice, but I think it's Kaylin. <laughs> um, him, 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 or him. Well, sorry. We don't, we don't to answer it, it's definitely one of the freshmen here because there's a reason they came to the school. You know, they were recruited. So the best, the best player at this school. So basically, this is we're gonna redo true. the interview. So basically, yeah, let's redo the whole thing. Wait, can Michaela just redo the whole interview, dude? <laughs> <laughs> one more time. One more time. Okay, one more time. Yeah, I think that's a cut. She saw my eyes. She know I'm gone. I see some things that you might fear. I'm doing a show. Okay, ready? No. Ready? Oh. Ready? Are you ready? <laughs> Are you ready? <laughs> now it's time for Husky Focus. It's Alora, and today I'm here with Anna. And for Husky Focus, we're going to be focusing on NHS. But while I'm asking your questions, our challenge is in 10 minutes to draw each other. Obviously, one will be better than the other, but there's no judgment. I have a, a, a surprise for Anna. You look amazing. I know, I want to do my cool Bob Ross. <laughs> we'll get started. Start the timer, Sienna. Just a warning, if I ruin your face, I'm so sorry. Oh, I don't really care. I'm going to make your face look ugly. Three, two, one, go. I'll ask you the first question. Sure. Which is, what does like NHS do? Like? Uh, so NHS stands for the National Art Honor Society. And basically we're kind of like an agency for the arts. So where we get community service and we help the community, but it's more focused on art. How do you so you have an interview process. We make you fill out a form and you have to showcase your artwork. So you don't have to be good at art to be here, but they just have to show that they, they really want to learn about art and they're serious about it. Mine's just going to look like a circle with two eyes. That's okay. That's basically what it is. Another question I have. Yes, ma'am. So what's your favorite art medium question? Medium. <laughs> that. Digital. I adore digital art. I use an iPad Pro, okay. and I use an Apple Pencil, and I use this app called Procreate. What's your favorite thing to draw? My favorite thing to draw... Currently, I'm working on a koi fish, so that's right, right now that's my favorite thing to draw. I don't like fish. You don't like fish? No. They're really? kind of weird looking. Well, what, what are some of the, like, the biggest things you guys have done in NHS? Big, big projects. The murals. Our murals are huge. So we all have shifts and we all take control of our shifts. Like it's covers a whole wall. Oh, this looks really bad. I'm sorry. Advanced. I made you look like a man. Am I a pretty man? No. Oh. <laughs> so what's something you want to tell people about? Follow our Instagram at FPA underscore NHS to know more. We post a lot of fun stuff on there.
come. We like peas and carrots, Jenny and I. Run, Boris! Hey, stupid! Run! Okay, good. So let's go. Now it's time for On the Prowl. On the Prowl. Answers from the students about issues you care about. Hi, my name is Melody, and this is not a game show that got us in trouble. The rules of the game are simple. Each player must draw a card, and if it says safe, then you're safe. And if it has an X on it, then you must do the challenge written on the card, whatever it may be. But don't worry, no one got seriously hurt in the making of this. If you complete the challenge, you win points, and if you fail or the team makes too much noise, you lose. But remember, silence. Okay, one, two, three. Oh. Okay. Uh. <laughs> spin and drop. Player must sit in a chair while the other players spin them 20 times. Try not to throw up. Then the player has to stand up, drop a paper, and try to step on it. Remember silence. Round one is worth a hundred points. Ready? Begin. Unfortunately, the players were too loud, so they lose this round. Better luck next time. Round two, begin. One, two, three. Uh, pillow fight. The other players must hit the player with pillows with escalating strength. Remember, silence. This round is worth 200 points. Begin. <laughs> Again, the players are too loud, so they lose this round. Round three and... Oh my god, what are they doing? <laughs> Now it's time for pause for a cause. McDonald's is the place to rock. Yeah, it is a restaurant where you buy some food to eat. It's a good place to listen to the music. People flock here from all around to get down to the rock. Hello audience, I am one of the Husky Vision members, Jack Franco. It's only the third episode of Husky Vision this year, and I've received a lot of opinions and requests from you guys. I want a love story in Husky Vision. I want a love story in Husky Vision. I want a love story in Husky Vision. Well, all right, people. If you want love stories, then you got love stories. Action! This is Minju Kim, the only poor student at Fairmont Prep. She works hard, she has good grades, and she has dreams.
And this is Jaden Rowe, the richest kid at Fairmont Prep. He started his own company at the age of one and is now worth billions of dollars. That's when Jaden feels a flush in his heart. That's when Jaden knows he's in love. You want my destiny. I've never seen a girl like you. Would you like to be my girl? like her before. That's when Lily feels a sudden blossom in her heart. That's when Lily knows that she is in love. Now it's time for Top Dog News. Do you need a break from school? Yeah. Can you not wait till winter break? Yeah. The Thanksgiving break might be for you. What? This short break happens at the end of November. And it includes the weekend. Including the weekend? No way. That's basically just three days off. Woo, woo, woo. We're taking this break off to celebrate Thanksgiving. So we could eat a lot of good food like, like turkey, mashed potatoes, and cranberry sauce, and corn. It's spectacular, dude. I may be some pumpkin pie. Radical. So just you wait, because this break is like next week. Woo! Come on, come on. Let's get out of here. Uh, Woo! Done. Yeah. Dude, I love half days. Hey. Where are you going? It's half day. <laughs> no, it's not. On December 6th, it's not a half day. It's a full day of school. <gasps> Bros. Bro, what are you looking at? Oh, I'm just planning my milk day party. Milk day? What the heck is milk day? You don't know what milk day is? It's on the 20th of January. The 20th? Stupid! In the arms of I have a dream. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys in January for our next episode. And now it's time for Student of the Month.